Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited for today's video because I'm going to be sharing with you a Starbucks drink hack. So I have some stuff over here. And as you guys know, I drink Starbucks every single day. And it ha is seriously becoming a problem. I have tried so many different iced coffees, so many coffees like with our Keurig and everything else. I really don't like hot coffee. I am definitely an iced coffee kind of girl. So I'm gonna put this little hack to the test and we'll see if I like this coffee so I can start making it at home. So I've been doing my research and I think that I have the exact ingredients that I'm going to need. So first I have this Starbucks iced coffee. This is the medium roast and I just got this at Target. And then I have um, Dairy Pure Half and Half. I really like Half and Half in my coffee. And then, I am such an idiot, but I don't know why I have never been able to figure this out. So obviously, I like my coffee sweet and I cannot drink this alone with just the Half and Half. And I recently found out that Home Goods and um, World Market carries this Tirani vanilla bean syrup. They have so many different kinds of syrup. They have like raspberry, coconut, really hundreds of syrups that you can get. And all that you do is just add this to your coffee or whatever you want to add it to, I guess. So this is my first time doing this, as you can see. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add this pump. Whoa! I just made a mess. That just went everywhere. See, this is why I don't ever try to do anything like this. This is, oh, there we go, okay. Okay, so every time that I go to Starbucks, I get the same thing. I actually got Starbucks this morning. I know I'm so bad, but basically my order every time is a grande iced coffee with vanilla sweetener and extra cream. I just cleaned out my grande coffee cup and I think that I know how to do this. So I'm pretty sure that the regular grande cup is four pumps of sweetener. So if any of you baristas are watching this video, leave some tips down below for me because I really am trying to get this right. So I'm gonna go ahead, and of course it's not gonna start coming out yet. Okay, so four pumps. And Caleb's going to be my taste tester here. It smells good. I got some on my hand. Oh, does it? Yeah, it does. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so then I'm going to try this iced coffee. And just for a price reference, I think I spent, how much is my coffee? It's like three bucks. Can you check on the app? Yeah. We're going to get an exact amount because I know I've been bad. Caleb doesn't want to tell me how bad I am, but... She has a reward. I do, I have a reward. Oh, I think yeah. that the iced coffee was like five or six dollars. And then the sweetener is, this says $5.99. But I mean, this is gonna last me forever. And then that half and half was just like $2 or something. Pretty sure it's $2.75. Okay, so my drink is $2.75. And then sometimes I get a venti. Which is like $3.75. About $3.15, I think. Yeah, because yeah, like so, uh, 3 Yeah, so 3 So really, about, let's just say $3, yeah. roughly, that I'm spending every single day. So I got to figure something out here. Huh. Yep. Yep. Okay, so I like a lot more cream with my coffee. So I've tried to watch them make this a couple of times. So I think that you add the coffee about this high, like to that line right here. And I'm probably doing this wrong. I think actually I was supposed to add the ice last, so whatever. I'm already messing up. Trial and error. That's what I know. Whatever. And then I'm going to add this half and half. And you guys, I like more cream than anything. Yeah, it's looking pretty legit to me. I mean, yeah. it looks like the normal color that I usually get your coffee. Yeah. It does look cream. See, I'm a hot drinker. I like my hot cured coffee. Yeah, Caleb's a weirdo. Ooh. Ooh hoo hoo. Almost like your coffee normally gets at Starbucks. Mm. 
Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just, like, exact. Ooh, I like that. I really like that. You guys, wait, I think I need to add a little bit more coffee. What do you think? I said it tastes a lot more, like a lot more creamer. That's good though. Let me just go get myself a job at Starbucks. You always say if you need a job. Oh yeah, that's better. You said if you always oh need a job. Oh my gosh. That yeah. is legit. Yeah, that tastes like <gasps> coffee. Oh my gosh! <laughs> great. <laughs> hey, no, great. No, no. no, this is gonna save us so much money. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I will just have to see if they keep an eye out if, like, they run sales on this guy. Because this is going to, I mean, that's, as you can see there, I don't know if you guys can see, that's what four pumps, but I mean, that's barely anything. So this should last you a, a, a while. long time, yeah. Mm -hmm. Basically, I think I just, I cracked Starbucks. I think I did pretty good. I think that this is a great hack. So I hope that you guys found this video helpful. And if you've been trying to get your iced coffee right, I think the biggest thing is getting a thing of sweetener. Like I said, they have so many different sweeteners like raspberry, coconut, hazelnut. Caramel. Um, yeah, caramel. I can't even remember what well, they, they had. A lot, yeah. yeah, they have like a ton. So I'm sure that if you go on to worldmarket.com, you'll be able to get them. They also have them at like Home Goods and TJ Maxx in the food section. So you guys will definitely have to check that out. And I think I'll probably play around the sweetener a little. This tastes really sweet. Yeah, the pump too. We end up getting this syrup at um, Home Goods, but they didn't have the pump. Yeah, so, we so the had pump was at World Market. World Market, so we had to go there. Separate. Yeah, so I mean, I think that I'll have to play around with the sweetener a little bit. Maybe next time I'll do three pumps. But like I said, if any of you baristas are watching this video, let me know how many pumps actually go into a grande. I think it's four, but... Maybe I'll try three the next time, but I'm really excited and I'm really happy because I've been trying to make my coffee at home for so long and I think I finally have figured it out. So I wanted to share it with you guys. Please leave a comment down below and let me know what your favorite Starbucks drink is and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.